Let's say loud, hallelujah. I'm referring to 21 persons who will receive 24 hour miracles. Shout aloud, hallelujah. God is good. He has done me well, oh my soul. Rise up and praise thy Lord. God is good. He has done me well, oh my soul. Rise up and praise the Lord. God is good. He has done me well, oh my soul. Rise up and praise the Lord. God is good. He has done me well, oh my soul. Rise up and praise the Lord. 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 He has broken the gates of us. And caused a bass of the world. He has broken the gates of us. And caused a bass of the world. He has broken, he has broken. He has broken the gates of us. Hallelujah. He has broken the gates of brass, and for the pass of Bayon is under. He has broken the gates of brass, and for the pass of Bayon is under. The God that answered by fire, that it be my God, that answered by fire, that it be my God, that answered by fire, God that answered by fire, that God that answered by fire. 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 Quere, Ogadi Rigima, you quere Nike Zos, Ogadi Rigima, Quere, Ogadi Rigima, you quere Nike Zos, Ogadi Rigima, Quere, Ogadi Rigima, you quere Nike Zos, Ogadi Rigima, Quere, Ogadi Rigima, you quere Nike Zos, Ogadi Rigima, you quere Nike Zos, Ogadi Rigima, you quere Nike Zos. Sunana, 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 I am Shiga, the King is Afira, Sunana, 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 I am Shiga, the King is Afira, Sunana, I am Sunana, Sunana, I am Shiga, the King is Afira, Sunana, I am Sunana, Oni Shara, Oni Shaya, Oni Shara, the Lord. Oh yes, 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 Ewa wa ba wa o, ewa wa ba wa o, ewa wa ba wa o, ewa wa ba wa o. Jesus, ewa wa ba wa o, ewa wa ba wa o, ewa wa ba wa o, ewa wa ba wa o. Aya cha cha cha.
If God has brought you to this crusade, it must be that there are miracles in your life that must happen by fire, by force. If God has brought you to this God of wonders crusade, it must be that all the gears of your enemy must be put in reverse position. If God has brought you to this meeting, it means that you are the next candidate for uncommon testimonies. I am going to pray now. It's not a gentleman's prayer. It's a prayer to dismantle every enemy of your destiny. It's a prayer to pull down any stronghold that has been joining with you. Perhaps you have been saying, when will my deliverance come? When will I testify? Why is the battle so hard? You have arrived at the right meeting. Let your amen be super dynamic. As, as I pray now. You can see that we are not here to joke. We are here for serious business. Your enemies must regret that you are here tonight. All eyes closed. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for the gathering of your children here. We thank you because you are the King of Kings, you are the Lord of Lords. We thank you for your absolute power. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Father, it is written that though we walk in the flesh, we do not walk after the flesh. But the weapons of our warfare are not canon. But they are mighty through God. To the pulling down of strongholds. Casting down every imagination. And every power that exalts itself against the knowledge of God. And bringing into captivity. All thanks to the obedience of Christ. Therefore, every stronghold presented here tonight. Within or without. I pull you down in the name of Jesus. I pull you down in the name of Jesus. Right there where you are. From the grip of the covens. From the grip of bondage. From the grip of infirmity. From the grip of bad luck. From the grip of curses. From the grip of failure. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. Receive it. 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 
Let your amen roar like thunder. Receive it. 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 Yes, that's the power of God. It's moving from person to person. Receive your deliverance. Receive it. Receive it. Aha. Benny. Yes. That is the power of God coming upon you. That the yoke of the wish can have been broken. Yes. Let her go. Let her go. Remove the stone. You are put in a body. Remove the chain upon the waist. Remove the chain upon the legs. You can't hide. Every evil hand laid on this boy. The evil hand laid on the womb of that woman. Fire is coming upon you where you are. Yes. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. I'm going to count seven from here. The power of God will fall upon 201 people who have been caged by their own parents. Consciously or unconsciously. They are struggling now because of the mistakes their parents made. As I count seven from here, the fire of God will fall upon you where you are. And that that yoke shall be broken instantly. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Let her go. Let her go. You, the husband from the waters, you can't marry this girl again. Let her go. Let her go. Every Oloku spirit, lose your hold from that lady. With a sevenfold amen. Let your voice roar like thunder as I pray this prayer. Any power that does not want your story to change. I bury them now in the name of Jesus. I want your amen to be more aggressive. Any power that is mocking your prayers. I command them to be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Is monitoring your children for evil. I command them to die in the name of Jesus. Something is happening. Just open your mouth. Something is happening. I 
Uh, is someone in this gathering? They have told you that this sickness can never go away. But the truth is that <laughs> it has gone away now. Jesus. 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 And there are three persons here. Meta la when you are not over nehi within ten days after this crusade. La rio jome wa le ita pari soji yi. You will receive a testimony. Oro eri o le o riba that will rewrite your family history. Eti o tu ito ebi reko. Thank you, Jesus. Esu Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Esu Jesus. Silence. I'm going to count seven again. There will be a volcanic eruption of God's power. In the womb of several women. And what they say is not possible for them. Will become possible immediately. One. Any. Two. Eight. Three, four, five, six, seven. That's the first person. That's number two. The power of God is falling upon you. decree once again every arrow of backwardness every arrow of the spirit of death and hell every arrow of failure at the edge of breakthroughs every arrow of poverty backfire in the name of Jesus Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, King of Kings and Lord of Lords. In Jesus' name we pray. It is now your turn to pray. If you pray these prayers and you lose your voice, but you receive your testimony, you have made a good Again. But if you keep quiet, but a back panoma, or you say I've prayed it before. There was a motive baro, I do right. There is a different anointing here tonight. As you pray this prayer, be out of badura, all the chains on the body shall be broken to pieces. Why you just see where we all the unexpected failures. Shall terminate. Those stubborn infirmities. They shall go back to their senders. Sisters, are you here tonight? Can I hear the sisters shouting this loud and clear? Oh, no, so feeble, no. There is a woman who needs to shout his name. Let the brothers roar like thunder. Everybody together now. Continue, continue. Open your mouth, open your mouth. That's why you are here. Bakate setela kaya bo shendera ba. 
Rimo saponda kaya bosha tera bosanda. Amen. Amen. Aha. Benny. See what is happening now. Eh, won't touch the lebay. See what is happening. Eh, won't touch the lebay. Lay your right hand on your head now. Eh, be your what really or you buy? This is the second prayer. I want you to shout. Like fire and like thunder. You will shout your name. Daniel Olukoya. Christopher Olumu. Hear the word of the Lord. Arise and shout. In the name of Jesus. Command your head to arise and shine. ready. They cause it time. In Jesus' name, we pray. Thank you, Evolifa. Father, continue to lay your hands upon your people. Baba, see what you see, Emma, da, wo, Let there wa. be no one in this crusade that will go on with a plastic experience. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Before you sit down, go to three people. Go to the metal. Tell them, my friend, every move of your enemies shall become your testimonies. Say it to three people. Amen. Ah. Me. Don't sit down here. Yeah, don't sit down. MIT yeah. Joko. MIT Go Joko. to seven persons. Say, my friend. I love you with the love of Christ. But my miracle shall be bigger than yours. In the name of Jesus. Say to seven persons. Seven persons. Amen. Amen. Don't sit down yet. Now look for ten persons. Make sure they are ten in number. Say, my friend. Any power that wants you to die. Shall die in your place. In the name of Jesus. Ten persons. Make sure they are turning number. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. I'll be sitting in the presence of the Lord. I bring you greetings on behalf of my wonderful wife. Who asked me to say to all of you that the Lord will over answer your prayers. So nice to have all our senior pastors here. Pastor and the wife, God bless you. All the senior regional overseers, the regional overseers, you are welcoming Jesus. And God bless you. Thank you for coming.
All the regional officers and the pastors here. Thank you for and all the members of the regions gather here, we salute you. God bless you, Jesus. Listen to this short message. Listen very carefully. Connecting to the God of all possibilities. Connecting to the God of all possibilities. In Jeremiah chapter 32. Verse 27. Jeremiah 32. 27. Connecting to the God of all possibilities. Jeremiah Jeremiah 37, 32, 27. 32, 27. Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything? too hard for me. Behold, I am the Lord. The God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? This is where we got our song. Behold, I am the Lord. The God of all flesh. Is there anything? Is there anything too hard for you? Is there anything, anything, anything too hard for me? Is there anything? Is there anything too hard? Oh, then in the book of Matthew, chapter 19, verse 26, Matthew 19, 26. I see somebody here tonight. They drank all your blood in the witchcraft coven. But as I'm speaking now, your blood is coming back into your body. I saw another person here. They have practically transferred the brain of your child to the coven. And that child is doing what is not convenient to his life. But as I speak now, the arrows have gone back to the senders. In Matthew chapter 19, verse 26, but Jesus beheld them and said unto them, with men, this is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. Meaning that God is a specialist at doing the impossible. Nothing is too hard for him. So your problems are not your problems. But ignorance about the limitless, boundless, awesomeness of the power of our God. Your problems are not your problems. It's ignorance on how to connect to the God of all possibilities. Ignorance of the secrets of God. When you connect to our God, you are connected to him 
Whose power has no measure. Whose power has no comparison. You connect to him whose power is uncontestable. You are connecting to him whose power is unchallengeable. You may be challenging other people, but not the Almighty God. When you connect to this God we're talking about, the God of possibilities, you are connecting to the God who rules from continent to continent. He rules from nation to nation. He rules from city to city. He rules from village to village. He rules from family to family. When you connect to this God of possibilities we're talking about, you are connecting to God who is beyond the calculation of arithmetic. You are connecting to the God who is beyond description. The God who is beyond analysis. The God that cannot be subjected to any scientific analysis. Doctors may speak experts may speak but there is someone who has an overruling voice who can cancel everything they say when you connect to him you are connecting to that God who is beyond the boundaries of human language. The one with the imperial power. The one with the formidable power. The one who can do all things, who knows all things. If I begin to give you instances, testimonies, not stories, the one I saw with my eyes. Like this. We'll be here till next year. A woman came to Palm Exchange. Out. She was on the water of fire program. She was on the water of fire program. She was on the water of fire program. She was on fire program. She was on the water of 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 fire she had three sons. All the three sons were mad. What a tragedy. When three sons are mad in the house. So in, in that street, they have given her a name. Mama Weary. Mama Weary. Mother of the insane people. They have given her a nickname, the, mother, the mother of the insane. I'm praying for somebody here. Any evil name the enemy wants to stamp on your head. Shabbat fire in the name of Jesus. Shabbat fire, Shabbat fire, Shabbat fire, Shabbat fire, Shabbat fire, Shabbat fire. In the name of Jesus. Lord, amen. These children were so mad that the psychiatric drugs were useless. They've used the drugs on them. It's not working. So, and this was a rich woman. So what, what she did is there are three rooms in her boys' quarters. Put, put them in chain in each of the rooms. They are very violent. Very violent. So that was what she left at home. She came to prayer city at the water of fire program. Her first time. 
We prayed on the water. She took the water home in faith. I'm believing there will be somebody here today. Those who saw you coming for this crusade. When they see you going back. You will have been a testimony. So she got home from the water of fire program. She went to the room of the senior boy. 37 years old. Night. She went there. She kept a safe distance. Very violent. Took one bottle of the water. Sprinkle it on the boy. All of a sudden, there was a transformation. The lion-like look on his face just disappeared. She said, Mommy, Mamabi, Mommy, Mamabi, Mommy that has never come out of that mouth for 20 years. Mama, a day, Mamma, Bolo, Mamma, could tell you that they will go or do say. Mommy, Mamma, give me more of that water. Effumini or me, I see. So she gave him another bottle. Lobato Funi, go me, Miron. He drank the whole bottle. Lotu beg, go, go, me, no, go, no, mu. I said, Mommy, only Mamma, me. What am I doing in this room? Who tied my hands? And he started to cry. Mommy said, eh? Mama said, ah! Jesus. Jesus. Quickly. She went back to the rest of the water of fire. This time she didn't use the bottle. She poured the water into a bucket of water. Went to the second room. Emptied the bucket on the head of that one. That one become healed. That one received healing. Now he went, she went to the third person. The same thing. Water on top. He became healed. This was how. Within 30 minutes. The problem of 25 years. Vanished. And the name they gave to her in the place changed. So, Mama, testimony. God is still in the business of doing the impossible. That is no problem too hard for God to solve. When you begin to talk about the Almighty, there is nothing like impossibility in its dictionary. No matter how strong your opposers are, one word from the Lord will scatter all of them. There is no enemy too hard for God to dismantle. God can create something out of nothing. I could remember the woman that came to the headquarters with a bulging stomach. She said she went to the native doctor. The native doctor says, this is stone. The enemy has put stone in your womb. Then she stopped going to the native doctor. Went to the hospital. The hospital says it's multiple fibroids that has joined together. But when she arrived in her place, the Lord said, I said, baby, is that place? Baby and do you know that the stone, the fibroid, became babies? I'm praying for somebody here. Your miracle shall give birth to other miracles. Your 
When they got the possibility, opens a door. No man can shut it. And when he shuts a door, no man can open. If you try to open it, it will slam on your face. The God of possibility never fails. Years back, a lady came. Lord, do me look on saying you're happy to come. I was crying that Gio pray for me. One so cooked better. I love you to have bad rough for me. I must marry. More lattice shake by a woe. I don't know why men are avoiding me. Me or more direct. See, I walk with him in South for me. Gio, I love you to if you pray for me. The bad bad rough for me. And I marry. Timothy Dent or Lock or Lori. I will bring you a good one way. Would I walk for you? I said, don't, don't worry about the goods. Said, but I think I know why these men are not coming. This lady, oh, this lady was, this tall. I was looking at her and talking to her like this. I said, I think I know why the men are not coming. But take this prayer. Pray for 21 days. I forgot about her totally. Until one day she appeared in my office. This tall man. I said, who is this one? My husband to be. I'm praying for somebody here. Any power that does not want you to marry. Any power that does not want your wedding bells to ring. Shall be buried alive in the name of Jesus. The power of God can make a way where there is no way. And let me tell you one secret. The plan of God cannot be troubled by any human power. And this God we're talking about. The God of all possibilities. It's a God of 24-hour miracles. Joseph rose Joseph from the prison to the palace in 24 hours. Mordecai's breakthrough came in 24 hours. Blind Bartimaeus' miracle, miracle came in 24 hours. The story of Moses changed in 24 hours. So I decree by the decree of heaven that your story must change in the name of Jesus. It must change. It must change. It must change. It must change. In the name of Jesus. Your miracle shall surprise your friends. And shock your enemies. In the name of Jesus. Let me share these two testimonies with you. Before we start praying now. It was when Martin of Fire newly started at Old Jabba Road. A lady who was a former prostitute joined us. Joined us. But during the prostitution, the womb developed cancer. So they did a surgery for her and took out the womb to save her life. So she had decided that she just wants to be serving God. She doesn't want to marry anybody again. There is no womb. But one day, one brother went to her. Said, Sister, God said you are my wife. She didn't answer. She didn't answer at all. And the brother kept troubling her. So one day she, she faced the brother. Said, brother, don't you want to have a child? Stop troubling me. There is no womb. The brother said, God did not tell me whether there is a womb 
and there is no womb. God just said, this is your wife. And so they, and so they get married. They got married. They got married. The pregnancy of this sister. And a delivery of a baby boy. Was what converted the doctor who did the surgery. Because he kept saying, but, but I don't understand, but I removed the womb. <laughs> I removed the womb, I don't understand. I removed the womb, I don't understand. That's what he kept saying. The miracle of that sister shocked even the doctors. Your miracle shall shock your enemies in the name of Jesus. Light your amen, roar like thunder. They rushed a lady to my office in those days. They could hardly walk. And they said she was over two years pregnant. The baby was not coming out. We prayed. Anointed that tummy with her. All of a sudden, she fell into labor. She delivered a nylon bag. What kind of wickedness is this? They planted nylon bag into a womb. And she, she now gave birth to a baby boy. After that miracle. But my joy is that about two or three years ago, three years ago, I was at our church in Canada. A young man was greeting me. And I just greeted him and walked away. He said, Gio, you don't know me. I said, I don't know you. Do you remember the boy whose mother delivered a nylon bag before he was delivered? I say yes. Say, say, I am the I'm the person. Your miracle shall shock your friends and surprise your enemies. But let me give you a few counsel tonight before we pray. Don't entertain any thought of failure. Stop meditating on the magnitude of the problems. Stop focusing on the difficulty. Focus on the solution. Don't say, this Goliath is so big, we cannot win him. But say, this Goliath is so big, there is no way my stone will not touch his head. Stop listening to the symptoms of the sickness. Try to believe, then you will see. Many want to see before they believe. No, believe first. Tonight, you need to surrender your life to the Lord Jesus Christ. And you need to repent from your sins. Then you need to cry to the God of possibilities. All who cried unto the God of possibilities in the Bible, God answered their prayers. The same thing shall happen here tonight. Rise to your feet now. But you see, if you are here tonight and you are not born again, you have not surrendered your life to Jesus. I'm here to help you. I want to give you maximum assistance. And we don't have time 
Tomorrow is Sunday. We don't have time. So if you are here tonight, you don't want to miss your miracle. And you have not just your life to Jesus. I'm just going to count one to ten from here. Run quickly to this altar. If you don't get here before ten, I assume that you don't want to surrender your life to Jesus. And we go on with the service. So, rise your feet, run quickly to the altar here if you want to surrender your life to Jesus. One, two, follow Jesus. Three, I have this. Four, to follow Jesus. Six, I have this. Stand up, stand up, stand up. To follow Jesus. No turning back. No turning back. I have decided. I have decided to follow Jesus. Yes, I have decided. persons who are supposed to join them at the front here. God brought you to this crusade. Because the enemy has planned to terminate you this year. But you have a great opportunity not to allow that to happen. But you need to surrender your life to Jesus. You are there. So because of you, I'm going to hold on for one more minute. Yes, young man. Yes, you're part of them. You know what you have been smoking. Find a way to do it very quickly. Surrender your life to Jesus. I say yes, yes, Lord. I say yes, yes, Lord. Yes to your will. I say yes. eliminate this year. You know yourself. Don't, don't be afraid. Don't be shy. What Those of you at the altar, bow down your heads and say what I'm going to say after. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. As from today, I say bye-bye to the devil. I enter into the kingdom of light. In Jesus' name. Amen.
Amen. Thank you. The last person has just joined us. Father, I thank you for your children here. Let your anointing fall upon their lives. Keep them standing by your power. Today that they have surrendered their lives to Jesus. Let their lives no longer remain the same. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name. Open your eyes and look at me. You've taken the most important decision in life. Just, just follow these pastors for one or two minutes. Come go this way, follow them. God bless us to do so. God bless us to do so. On the mountain, in the valley, on the land, and in the sea, on the mountain, in the valley. pictures, any faith materials here. This is the time to bring it out and remain standing as you do so. Your oil, water, 
handkerchief, picture, implements of business. Bring it out as we pray now. Something is about to happen that will change your life totally. Father, in the name of Jesus, in the beginning, the Spirit of God moved upon the waters. Let your Spirit move upon the water and the oil in the name of Jesus. Let your spirit move upon these faith materials in the name of Jesus. With these articles of faith, let there be dumbfounding testimonies in the name of Jesus. Let the power of God flow upon these materials for complete breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Oh God that doeth hard things. Oh God of all possibilities. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. And Father, anyone here with a prayer request, let the prayer request become testimonies. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch your right hand towards this altar now. Your right hand towards the altar. Father, let your miracle power flow into these hands now. Let these hands become the hands of healing. The hands of deliverance. The hands of power. The hands of glory. In the name of Jesus. Father, I'm praying for everyone gathered here. Anyone suffering from any infirmity. Witchcraft sponsored infirmity. I command the infirmity to go back to the senders in the name of Jesus. You, the spirit of cancer, I bind you and I cast you out. You, the spirit of fibroid, I bind you and I cast you out. You the spirit of asthma. I bind you and I cast you out. You the fainting spirit. I bind you and I cast you out. You the spirit of paralysis. I bind you and I cast you out. You the spirit of high blood pressure. I bind you and I cast you out. In the name of Jesus. It is written that you yourself bore our infirmities and took away our sicknesses. The chastisement of our pieces upon you and by your stripes were healed. By the stripes of the Lord Jesus Christ, receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Now, if you have any infirmity in any part of your body, smite 21 hot times, shouting, go back to your senders. Let's go! Do it well, do it well. Something is happening. Every heavy load upon the head, I command you to be removed. All the weak legs receive strength now. The weak hands receive strength now. The weak eyes receive your healing now. The weak ears receive your healing now. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Begin to check your body now. Put your faith into a prayer. Check your body now. Begin to do what you could not do before you got here. 
Check that that pain. It has gone. Check the swelling. It has gone. Something is happening over there. A surgery is taking place in the life of that person. That evil material has been taken out of your body. Check your body very well. Once you have been healed, don't let the devil put it back. Don't let the devil put it back. Find a way to this altar. Run quickly to this altar. So you can have a seal on your miracle here today. See what is happening to that woman. She cannot believe it, but it has happened. Find a way to the altar very quickly. Check your body very well. And find a way to the altar. Yes, don't let the devil put it back. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, shake that head. The heaviness has gone. Check that womb. The evil plantation has been removed. Find a way to the altar very quickly. Jesus is waiting for you. Here. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Right there where you are. You will raise up your voices again with fire and with thunder. Say, my story must change by the power in the blood of Jesus. Shout it again. Let your voice be louder than that. Open your mouth and pray like that. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now say, Oh God of signs and wonder. Oh Lord, I am available. This is me by fire. In the name of Jesus. Visit me by fire. By no. Aha. Benny. Aha. Benny. Aha. Benny. Amen. Amen. This particular prayer should be prayed three hot times. Don't let your voice don't let anybody's voice overshadow your voice. Because there are testimonies attached to this source. Yes, still check your body over there. See, something is happening to you. It has changed your life completely. Don't let the devil put it back. Can you shout this loud and clear? That hate my existence. Is that the loudest you can shout it? Your voice is not loud enough. You are alive! In the name of Jesus. Something is happening over there. Mm. 
Receive your breakthrough. Receive your breakthrough. Receive your testimony. Receive your breakthrough. Receive your testimony. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and pray it a second time. Makate sete de ke ya bo shente ra bo kontani la kaya. In Jesus' name we pray. Get us up ready. This is the third time. Open your mouth and pray.